Hi guys, welcome to Makeup Cafe. So colorful eyeliners can sometimes make us feel really uneasy. So today I'm going to tell you how you can wear a vivid pink eyeliner and look nothing extra. So let's start by this Huda Beauty Desert Dusk palette which is such a versatile palette that it covers so many useful colors. Let's pick this cool brown eyeshadow which is called amber and use it as a transition color for our eyes. Let's just blend it now. And with the dark brown color, let's do the crease. If you're not familiar with these terms and you struggle with the basic eye makeup, just watch the video above and keep blending this two until the two colors merge. Now let's pick this nude color and just normally apply it as an eyeshadow with an eyeshadow brush. Now let's pick the most gorgeous color from the palette which is twilight and highlight the inner corner and the brow bone. Now let's pick the NYX vivid eyeliner in the shade petal. Start with the wing and come back to complete the eyeliner. You can watch the wing eyeliner video too if you struggle with the wing eyeliners. I even got this on my eyelashes because of the shape and length of the brush, but it's okay, we can remove it. So now with a black eyeliner or gel eyeliner, whichever you prefer, just draw an outline only on the wing. Do not go too dramatic, just the wing, that's it. So we are almost done now, just replicate it on the other eye. Okay. So with a highlighter, let's just tap tap it on the center of the lid. I use my fingers because sometimes they are the best tools you need. And now for the face, I'm toning it with the Ginseng and Rice Toner by Body Shop. Now let's take the MAC Waterweight Foundation which is my current favorite and let's drop it on my face. And let's blend it with a beauty blender. Mine is broken now but it still works fine for me because I have to recover the cost before throwing this one. This one is hell expensive. So just blend now using your fingers or your blenders or brushes, whichever is your style of putting your base on. Keep pushing the product. Now with the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer, let's conceal the under eyes, corner of the mouth or anything you want to hide. And let's blend this too. I really like this concealer for the coverage, finish and the texture as well. And this one is economical and easily available. And now with my broken NYX highlight and contour palette, let's take this yellowish banana powder and settle the under eyes specially or anything you feel like baking. Now let's pick the contour color and contour the cheeks. See the effect in both the cheeks, this side looks so much toned up, that's the effect of contouring if it's done in the right manner. Now let's pick the blusher, please find the description of all the products below. I really like to use a slant brush for blushing my face. And now with the highlighter, let's highlight everything possible. I'm just kidding, go very natural with this. You can also use your fingers like I do for some areas like tip of the nose or maybe center of the forehead. Uh, this really gives intensity of the highlighter. This one is the JLO X Inglot Collection Lipstick and the shade is Brandy. It's a gorgeous dark brown if you also love browns. The texture of the lipstick is wow. It's long lasting, it's moisturizing and so comfortable on the lips even better than the MAC lipsticks. Yes guys, you really gotta go and try these and prices are same as the MAC ones. In fact, the color range is also very cool. So now I'm taking the NYX Nude Crayon to give an ombre effect to the lips. Just apply it to the center and baby blend it. Just blend it. Now let's finish up by lining the lower lash line with the dark brown eyeshadow. You can also leave this step if you do not like to line your lower lash line and some fancy lashes these are scarlet by huda beauty so guys we're done enjoy this funky pink eyeliner look and some chocolatey lips and do not forget to subscribe i'll see you very soon in my next video
बाय एंड आई लव यू सो मच बाय